So the first thing you have to do when you're installing the unit is you have to install the ears onto the unit. And the ears, this is a 3U unit. There are holes on the side of the unit already pre-drilled. There's the front position for a four post rack. And there's a middle position or back position if you're doing a two post rack and don't have a two post rail kit. In this video, we're gonna show the front position because we're installing in a four post rail kit. The screws are all supplied in the packaging. So since we're installing a 3U high unit, we have to install the cage nut so that when you put the ear on, it has something behind that, that hole to, to go into since the rail kit's only 2U high. So now we're ready to go ahead and install the unit. Typically have one person in the back, one person in the front, set the unit onto the rail kit. And there's a little cleat on both sides of the unit that goes into the slot in the rail kit itself. And it takes a little bit of maneuvering and finagling until it gets in there. Now we can use the screw to go into the cage nut. And then the screw that I showed earlier, that's going to go into the, the one without the crush washer. That's going to go into the rail kit through the front. Repeat it that for the other side. And now the unit is secure. Now we'll go ahead and install the batteries into the unit. For this particular unit, it's going to take two battery packs, which is actually one RBC 140. You're going to slide those units in. Make sure you do not lift those battery packs by those cords. And you're going to take the cord and you're going to plug it into the mating receptacle that's right above that battery pack until you hear it click. Go ahead and do the same for the other one. I'm going to close the door and then we're going to secure the screws and we will go ahead and put the bezel back on. And then the next step is just to fire the unit up. Installing the external battery pack is much as the same as installing just the unit itself. You put the external battery pack rail kit in, slide the unit into the rail kit. and install your screws on the front. Now the unit's in, you're just gonna go ahead and install the battery packs, just like you did in the main unit. Again, in the external battery packs, there's four, and again, don't, hook, don't lift up by the cord, put them in. Before you install the batteries connectors in the front, make sure that the connector is installed from the external battery pack to the UPS first. The vertical PDU is very simple to install. Unbox the PDU, line it up with the keyhole that comes on the back of the uh, APC rack and simply uh, line up both keyholes and slide the PDU in. Now it's just install the covers over the battery packs. You're gonna get underneath those wires. Don't pinch those wires in the uh, cover and there's thumb screws to go ahead and take them in you don't have to tighten them real tight because they're going to have to come out at some point again to replace those batteries in the future and snap the bezel in place and this entire unit is ready to be fired up